Hi everyone, I'm Wolfie, and in this video, I'm going to teach you how to capture a monster in Monster Hunter World. Now, the game itself doesn't make it completely clear how to do this, so I'm going to be going over it today. So, what I'm in here right now is one of the beginner investigations which require you to capture a monster, the Great Jagras, for this one specifically. Now, in this mission, they actually give you the supplies you need in order to capture the monster. So the items that you're going to need are over here in your chest, and they are easy trank bombs and an easy shock trap, both of which will be needed in order to capture a monster. Now, there are different types of traps which you can make in your tab, but know that it doesn't matter which type of trap you use, as they can all be used in order to capture monsters. And the same goes for Trank Bombs. Now in order to actually trap a monster, you must first weaken it enough so that you'll be able to capture it. How this works is as you're fighting monsters, you'll reach a certain point where the monster tries to run away while limping. Now the limp that they do is quite noticeable, so you should be able to recognize it without having to look too closely. Now as you reach this point, you want to avoid putting more damage on the monster as you see them trying to limp away. It's around this point that you're getting close to where you want to capture them. Now there are a couple of other indicators that you can pay attention to as well, one of them being the monster's heartbeat, which you'll see in the corner of the screen when it's close to flatlining. It's around that point that it will be slowing down and it's time to attempt to capture. The other indicator you can pay attention to is the monster having a skull icon on your minimap. Now once you've noticed some of the indicators, it's at this point that you're going to want to trail the monster as they're limping away. The monster will usually be heading for their nest area in order to sleep so that it can restore its health. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to follow it back to its resting area. And when you get there, you can walk right up to the monster as it's in its nest and you don't have to worry about it waking up as long as you don't attack it. Now it's at this point that you're going to attempt to capture it. So what you want to do here is get up close to the monster select your trap, and then place your trap down. It will immediately activate on the monster, and as soon as that happens, you're going to need to use two Trank Bombs. And then you've captured your monster. Now when you capture a monster, you will notice that you won't be able to carve off of it like you normally do when defeating one. But don't worry about that, you'll still get some materials. They show up at the completion screen, and that's where you'll be able to collect them. Alrighty, that's all for this one. If it helped you out, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'm Wolfie, and I'll see you out on the hunt.